back to another Delivered Reviewed. This week, finally, um, they actually delivered. So TGI Fridays, and this week, thank God, it is Friday. So finally, TGI Fridays, and um, I don't know what happened quite last week. The staff said they didn't have an order come through. As you can see there, a bit of a history on TGI Fridays. And um, yeah, it didn't happen last week. So this week it did happen. The staff were brilliant. Um, one of the girls rang me back uh, to say that the order had come through on Just Eat. So, you know, rather than waiting 20 minutes and it didn't turn up again. Uh, initially, everything looked brilliant. The packaging was brilliant. Um, the order in terms of the burger, you know, it was a little bit soft on the bottom, which you'll see in a minute, but... Uh, I thought, yeah, go back to TGI Fridays. I've literally not been there for over 10 years. Um, and I remember it was good food when I last went. So, you know, I thought, well, let's just try it. It's another one of those branded places that I've not tried yet. So the burger was a Friday's glazed chicken burger, lemon and garlic flamed, grilled, rather, chicken breast, coated in a Friday's legendary glaze, which is telling in a second, Monterey Jack cheese and crispy bacon served on a bed of lettuce, mayo, tomato, pickled red onions, extra Friday sauce on the side. Now, I didn't have the pickled red onions, as you know, I don't like onions. As you can see there, if we start off with the fries, they were, I think, really good. Um, crispy on the outside, soft on the inside, not too greasy, and from what I could see, pretty, pretty kind of seasoned, or at least a little bit of seasoning on them. So the fries were, were really good, um, not over the top, but they were good fries. Um, loads of dishes as well, which I didn't have. So again, the prices aren't, aren't cheap, but obviously nothing is these days, I must say every week. As you can see there, the glaze. So uh, as far as I can see, it's the uh, whiskey glaze made of Jack Daniels with brown sugar. Uh, herbs and spices to create this perfect blend and, and it was a it was a really nice sauce to be fair I'm not sure whether I had it years ago, but <clears throat> it was a it was a very nice sauce The mozzarella sticks um, been recommended as I love mozzarella sticks, but you'll see in two seconds I'm Not quite sure where the mozzarella was the outside coating was nice, but that looks like a bit of a cavern You know a cave, you know, maybe down the bottom end of the cave. There's some mozzarella, but there wasn't a great deal in there and I think pretty disappointing. Um, yeah, you got four of them. Uh, okay, then the crispy coating was nice and the kind of parmesan that's on the top. But that was about it. I also had blue cheese sauce with it and garlic aioli, just of those two sauces there. Um, but nothing to write home about the, the mozzarella sticks. So, again, not cheap either, as you can say. Uh, see, rather, £7.50. But onto the burger, and the burger was, was pretty nice, chicken breast was pretty nice, so it's a lemon and garlic flame grilled chicken breast coated in our Friday's legendary glaze, Montreal Jack cheese and crispy bacon served on a bed of lettuce, mayo, tomato, pickled red onions and extra Friday sauce on the side. I didn't have the pick, pickled red onions in terms of eating it, they came with it but I, I took them off. Um, but the lettuce, tomato, fresh, bun, brioche, fresh. And the bacon was, was pretty nice. It wasn't kind of bits, it, it was decent pieces of bacon um, with obviously the Monterey Jack cheese on top. As you can see there, chicken breast wasn't quite a Popeye's chicken breast, but I thought from having the chicken breast last week and obviously previous week, we'll carry on with the chicken burgers. But it was a nice chicken burger. It was a bit like a, a Nando's kind of chicken, if you, if you kind of think of Nando's, not got any real coating on it as such, lemon and, and garlic, obviously, as it says, but it's just a flame grilled piece of chicken. And it's a pretty substantial burger, like, I can't really knock it, it's, it was a nice burger. Uh, the bottom bun was a little bit soggy, again, being wrapped in foil. I don't know why they really need to do this, really. Paper would be more than adequate, and obviously kind of takes up a bit of the, the moisture. Um, as you can see there, quite a lot of fries you got with it. Um, the sauce, to say the glazed sauce, was, uh, in, in terms of Jack Daniels and, and the whiskey, it, it, was, it was nice, it was a really nice sauce. The blue cheese sauce, was a bit thin could have been doing with a little bit thicker but i mean either way as a an overall meal which you see obviously um kind of going back and looking at the the whole meal it was a nice meal but for the money again i, I can't say it was it was amazing um maybe just busy with it being friday night again maybe i'm choosing the wrong night to have these orders but either way eight out of ten for the burger 8.5 for the fries and the halloumi four out of ten at the most i appreciate everybody watching i appreciate the new subscribers and on to the next one next week